Hi guys, so today we are discussing the field parameters concept. So this is one of the trendiest interview questions nowadays. So to discuss this, first we'll uh, take a chart. Uh, and then I'm adding revenue to this. Uh, to x y axis and to x axis I'll take some category and uh, we'll see the chart how it looks now okay so here uh, I'm also turning on the data labels so when you turn on the data labels you can see the uh, revenue per category but now if you want to see revenue per city then what you have to do you have to remove the category and you have to give the city so like this if you want to uh, create for each one you have to create separate charts right so this will create take more memory and it will create many charts but instead of this now we have a new feature that is field parameters you can make this x-axis and y-axis dynamical dynamically so that you can change the things dynamically okay so that is the purpose of field parameters so how to do it you have to go to modeling you have to go to the new parameters and make sure you have to select the fields here okay click on fields now whatever you want to make dynamic in this case i want to make the uh, this category and city i want to make it dynamic so i'm selecting those two options and i'm getting create So now we got a slicer. So I did not create this slicer. Whenever you create parameter, then automatically you will get this slicer option. Now what you have to go do, you have to go to the chart. And uh, so this x-axis we are making dynamic, right? So whatever parameter you created, just remove the city here. And whatever parameter you created, this is the parameter which we created now. So just add it here. So now uh, when you click on category, you can see category wise revenue when you click on city you can see city wise revenue so what we did is we made the x-axis dynamic same way if you want to make y-axis dynamic steps are same just uh, go go ahead and make the y-axis as well dynamic so this is the concept of field parameters this is one of the most repeated interview questions nowadays so just go through it and also uh, by listening the video practice alongside so that you will understand it more perfectly okay if you like the video please like and subscribe so that i'll get motivation to make more such videos thank you